Okay. Hi, my name is Vicki Jones. I'm the innkeeper of Captain Henderson House. I've been here uh, ten and a half years. It's a 9,000 square foot Victorian home that was restored um, 99, 90, well they started in 97 and finished up in 99. Opened it up as a bed and breakfast and I'm the third innkeeper. We do eight rooms. Uh, it's kind of like coming to your cousin's house. We run it. It is a bed and breakfast but you have your own personal space. You have your own private rooms with private baths. You have the use of the downstairs foyers. We have a um, like a TV room. We have a music room. We have a we call it our little guest snack kitchen where the guests can go in and make their coffee. We bring up uh, snacks in the afternoon, cookies, chocolate, fruit trays. A lot of the families come. We have a game room that they can put puzzles together, or play games, just hang out. We do a lot of weddings, a lot of receptions, a lot of family reunions. So it's. It is a bed and breakfast, but we also use it for other functions or um, large family groups. Um, we do a full breakfast. We don't call it a gourmet breakfast because I'm too Southern to do gourmet. But we do always fresh fruits and juice and coffee, and then we have a meat, an egg, and a bread dish of some sort. Every day it's different. I am the main cook. Uh, I do have a, another cook that comes in on weekends and helps me out. Okay. The house was actually started by Captain Henderson, a small cottage. They added on, uh, he sold it, the Wilson family bought it. They added on to it, and then it was bought by the Phillips family, and then the Stone family married a Phillips, so it became the old Phillips Stone House. It's what most people in Arkadelphia know it as the old Stone House. And then the granddaughters who grew up here, Mary Jo and Ruth, actually sold it back to Henderson, um, I think in 78. And then Henderson used it as a museum for years. So I can't. I don't know exactly. I know they closed it down. I was a uh, homeschool mother for years and years and years, and we would do the tours in the when it was the museum. They had a Caddo Indian artifact collection. Then they closed the house and decided to either tear it down or restore it. And to Henderson's credit, they restored it yes. and then opened it back up. So. It's been, uh, Henderson has owned it since 78 and used it for different functions since then. I know when the Philip Stone family lived here, they renovated the upstairs and used them as apartments and then the family lived downstairs. Oh, yeah. My name is Vicki Jones and I'm the innkeeper of Captain Henderson House.